What is up everybody, it is your boy, Super Roman Reigns Nick here, and boy, it has been a long time since I've been on here. Sorry if I've been lacking on the content lately, but it seems to be a busy time for me to get setting things up, because of Super AJ Cell's Nick, and Super Jones in the next universe mode. But nonetheless, we're back, and today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be playing my GM mode. Yep. We're playing my DM mode. So, we got to ask ourselves a question. Who are we going to be playing with? Are we going to be playing as other players who has... Oh, who has an answer going to... It's Superstar DM Tony DeVille. Legend Whisper Willing Weagle. Coast to Coast, Shane McMahon. And then McMahon present in Stephanie McMahon. And then the beginner of the luck for like, Custom Wrestler. But I think... Wondering who's it gonna be. So, the anger to increase all the active wrestle rivalries by one. The super it can raise more all in by 15 plus. Legend Whisper, which has free signing for legends. Coast in it GM booked plus plus two for the show bonus, and then earn twice as much money from arena attendance this week. Because we have that. So now the question is, who are we going to be playing with? And I think I'm going to go William Weagle. And of course I'm new to this. So of course, on Smackdown we have Birth of Legends. Six random superstars uh, will get their popularity increased to plus six. War has three random superstars uh, on opposite opposing brand. Cannot be booked in ne matches next week. Cannot be used the, the week before a pay-per-view. The title match is booked for this week. Will receive a larger rating for the boost. And then, then the network deal will be tripped. And if they want to gain, and if you want to gain fans, if you gain fans, otherwise it will be double. So because of that, I think it's pretty cool, but I think I'm going to go to SmackDown. So the question is, who are we going to be taking on? And I think we're going to be taking on the best in the world, or what AC from NY, or Square in the Circle said, the best in the full in the world, Shane McMahon. Hmm. And then we're going to go 50 weeks on this. Eh? Alright, you ready for this draft? Oh, and by the way, there's another thing too. You have custom feature as well. So which one am I going to go for? Do I do custom or do I go the regular? I think let's go the regular. Let's go. Alright, get out of my way. Alright, each GM will start with a budget at 2,750,000. GMs will take turns drafting one and another, starting with player one. There will be eight rounds of draft. After the eighth round, drafting becomes optional. GMs can opt out or draft until they're out of cash. GMs can press the R3 button on PS4 and PS5. To get recommendations on who to draft, you can also press square to get more information about the Simpsons. So let's go. Got a heavy monster we got there. So overall, the question we have to ask is, who is our first pick going to be? I think, well, I kind of want to go Becky Lynch, but I feel like they're going to take either John Cena or Brock Lesnar. Which I guess, well, let's see who's also on this list. We got AJ Styles, which, of course, I kind of want to well gate to the main event. So, we'll pick up Becky Lynch and see what happens. And it went for Brock Lesnar, which I told you it was going to happen. So, what's next? Because we're going to capitalize our main event division for the blue brand. 
would be better if we had Roman Reigns, but we don't. We're going to pick John Cena up next, before Walt can do it. And they're going to go for the one-man Damien Priest. Who could have easily been a pick of mine, but I guess we can't do it. So, but we do need, so we now need to focus on the main event division, and we're going to pick up AJ Styles up next. Are we on there? And Walt's going to go for Alexa Bliss. Which is kind of funny, because I took Asuka. It's going to date, I mean, I took Becky Lynch, and it's going to happen that way. It's the only way we think. It's the only way we think. Alright. So, so now, next up, we're going to go with... Uh, Bianca Bella. Let's do it. Let's do Bianca Bella up next. And what's going to go for Tamina, who wants a 51 popularity for the next pick. I don't. So let's see who do we got. Oh, that could be a great fit to the main event division. So, so Drew McIntyre is probably going to be taking next, unless if it's over 24/7 jobbers. Oh, Bala is in question, which I think. Well, I think if I take Bala, they're going to take someone. Well, let's go for it and see what happens. And they're going to go for Drew McIntyre, which they need to think about the main event division on their show because. For what right now we have Brock Lesnar and Drew McIntyre and Tamina and Alexa Bliss. Actually, they have two titles. So we have Damien Priest, Drew McIntyre, Brock Lesnar for the WWE title, and Tamina and Alexa Bliss for the women's. So next up, we're gonna go Bailey, and I think they're gonna take Orton next. Nope, they go for MVP. Which does anyone want MVP? I do like MVP, but we need to dump down on the main event roster. Next up, we're going to need to get back into fresh faces for the WWE title division. I mean, the Universal title division in Randy Orton. And Walt's going to go for Sami Zayn. And we are at 1 million. And who's next we're taking? I'm probably going to go... King Nakamura. And we are at 8, 847,600. And Walt's going to go for Ivar. Thanks, Drew Gullock. Let's find out who I'm taking up next. Who we're taking next? I don't know who's who are going to be taking. Who do we have that I could get? Yeah. Hmm. Well, it's a tough choice to think who I'm going to go next. So right now we have Becky Lynch, Bianca Bella, and Bailey for the women's division, John Cena, Finn Balor, AJ Styles, King Nakamura, and Randy, or Randy Orton for the Universal Championship division. Oops, sorry. Monday Night Raw, Brock Lesnar, Sami Zayn, and Damian Priest, and Iva, MVP for the WWE title, Tamina and Alexa Bliss for the women's division. So let's see who are we going to be taking up next. I think we're going to take Shinna Basel up next. Let's do it. And one's gonna go for Kaylee Way. Does anyone want Kaylee Way? No. No. True. True. So let's see who we got left. We got Sasha Banks, which I think was gonna take. Charlotte, who hasn't been stolen, along with Rhea Ripley, which they will be in the moment. We have Walter, Nia Jax, Elias, Whittle, the Street Prophets, Yoshua, Keith Lee, Naomi, or Naomi, or whatever the hell you wanna call it. But I think next up, I'm gonna take. It's a really tough. So who do I? Who am I gonna be taking? Let's see. But I think I'm gonna go overall. Uh, I'm gonna go Keithley. Let's do it. Let's take Keithley. And was gonna go for Mandy Rose, because these prices look cheaper. So now we're looking at Becky Lynch and Bianca Bella, Bailey. And Shayna Baszler for the women's division. Keith Lee, Randy Orton, King Nakamura, AJ Bala, and Cena for the Universal Division. Oh boy. Are we pumped? Are we pumped all day? I think the next pick I'm gonna go is uh, I don't know if this cash is gonna work, but oh god, I think we gotta risk it, but I think we gotta do it. Yoshua, up next. Boom. And was going to go for Timothy Thatcher. So 
So now, we are now on 201,000. And I don't know who to sign next. Because we can't get Walter anymore. Nope. Because we're out of cash. Wondering who are we taking up next. Would be better if I opt to, to exit now. Because we're going to be out of cash in know it. Who we're gonna take now? Who do we, do we have the capable of the women's division? I think if it would be, I think it's probably gonna have to be Ember Moon. And there you have it. We got the draft completed. This is what we got for SmackDown. Let me take a beautiful screenshot of it. I'm probably going to re- Alright, so we're back. So now, let's see what Walt went for. So they went for Chad Gable. They went for Natalia. They went for Tony Storm. And now they're out. So now, Walt's main antagonist, uh, Brock Lesnar, MVP, Alexa Bliss, Drew McIntyre, Tamina, Ivar, Sami Zayn and Damien Priest. That's the best you got for Monday Night Raw. <laughs> yeah, right. Yep. So there you have it. Monday Night Raw is swooped into it. So let's see. So we're four weeks away from WrestleMania backlash. Tonight's the night. Well, we have high hopes. I was born for it. Good. Well, let's see if we can get the big thing. So now, we have Universal in the Women's Champion. Overall, we kind of did a good job with the women's and the men's division. We have 12. So who is going to be our first Universal Champion? I do have a lot of big things going. But I think I kind of want to do AJ vs. Balor. Although these two are both heels. I think I have to turn one of them face. But I think I got to... Well, I don't know how we're going to do it. Because... We need to turn Battle face. Uh, actually, we have to turn AJ face. And then for the SmackDown Women's Champion, we got to go with Mr. I mean, Miss Big Time Bags, Becky Lynch. So, of course, we got a lot of things we got. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. This is what we have on free agency right now. We're not going to find anyone for now. Yep, blah, blah, blah. And he's telling us do not put Cena in the match this week. So he said, so what are we going to do this week? So let's do the birth of Legends. Let's see who's going to get it. So we got to get the Becky Lynch, Randy Orton, Shayna Baszler, Finn Bauer, Bailey, and AJ Styles. Yep, that was pretty cool. So let's go ahead and book our first show. Shall we do it? Alright, so now, we are going to do something. So the first thing we have to do, how much does the world change cost? 10 pounds, which I don't think it's going to work. So, we need to turn AJ Styles face. For the main event tonight, we're going to have Finn Balor versus Keith Lee. And then, actually, I don't think you can do the one in interference. So we have to world change AJ Styles. We're going to have a call up between Ember Moon and uh, Bianca Bella. We're going to... Uh, Ember Moon and Bianca Bella. We're going to have Ida Shura and Shayna Baszler taking on Bailey and Becky Lynch. Then we're going to start the show off with... with oh, shit. Can't put Cena on the show tonight. So we're going to have Keith Lee versus, versus Shinsuke Nakamura. And then we're going to have... Actually, we are going to need to do something. Okay. I think we're going to need to do uh, self-promotion. Let's give it Cena. And Cena's not on this week's show. So this can make a good state. There you go. Oh, yep. I know it. You can do it. Okay. So there you go. We're ready to go. Let's see what we're going to get. And um, that show will cost 7500 Let's see what we're going to get this today.
Of course, let's see what this, what did we get tonight? For the first matchup between King Nakamura and Keith Lee, I think it's going to be a squash match. And it was disappointing, which that is not a great sign to see. And it was an okay promo by Bianca Bella and Ember Moon. I think this is going to be another disappointment. A disappointment. And I told, it was mediocre. And John Cena cut it an excellent promo. Let's see what Two, three. happened in the main event. And Randy Orton wins. And oh, that was bullshit. Sorry for throwing, but that's the truth. Did they get cost a DQ? Or something like that. Someone needs to tell me in the comment section. And we had a poor show. This is why we're going to lose. Because Alexa Bliss is the World Women's Champion and Brock Lesnar is the WWE Champion. But we're dead. We're bloody dead. Oh wait. Okay. I was trying to do something. I'll see to do it. Okay. See, we'll do it. All right. We'll do one more episode and we'll get. Uh. I'll do a deal. We'll do one more show and we're gonna close out today's episode. So we got 106 cash from the last episode. Of course, we got other the guys on free agency. Can try and use that legends thing to further bury ourselves. So it's not getting our cash back. There's no way that we're getting our cash back. We're done. We're dead. We're dead. Okay. We could try and do this. Okay. So what we're going to do, we need to correct our fuck up from last week. Sorry for swearing, by the way, but this is what we're going to do. We're going to have Finn Balor. Actually, so Balor is saying he wants a match for within three weeks. So what we're going to do is tonight's main event, we're going to have AJ Styles versus Finn Balor. Because Balor wants his match. Keith Lee wants the match. cut a promo and I don't know who can see a feud with actually we could do something okay here's what we're gonna do this is what I'm gonna do okay we're gonna have Becky Lynch versus Ember Moon actually let's have Becky Lynch why is Bianca's popularity low lower I don't even know, but what we're going to do, we're going to set up a feud. We're going to have a call out between Cena and Alton to begin that, actually, yeah, we want to do that. So, Keith Lee wants a match. I can get it. Keith Lee versus Nagamora, happening again. And we're going to have another call out between, unfortunately though. Bailey and Bailey and Bailey Bailey and is not gonna make it onto the show tonight. So let's go and simulate it. Maybe I should try and get that popularity to Ember Moon and just forget about Shinna this week. So let's find out how do we do tonight, and then we're gonna call off today's episode. So let's start with keep with Becky Lynch versus Bianca Bella. I think we're gonna get an F. Do many okay? Okay, I'll take it. First, I'm not gonna be enough. Good. I think Keith Lee's good. Nope, Nakamura wins. I knew it's disappointing. 
I know my moon is gonna get that one popularity. And then AJ Styles wins the main event. And it was disappointing. Are you fucking kidding me? Sorry for throwing. What? How do you think is that? We're losing in the ratings now. Is it because of my cash? Which is causing the problem? Like also, we've completed all these requests. I see who's on free agents right now. Nobody. Yeah, I care about. So we'll finish it off next time. Thanks for watching this episode and I'll see you all in the next episode. Thank you.